and you think we got progress progress ladies and gentlemen progress yeah seems the war with SOPA is far far from over what I'm reading here what I'm reading here is hmm What I'm actually reading here, excuse me, is something from Entertainment News. It says, Senate Minority Leader says anti-piracy bill has serious issues. Senate Minority Leader Mitch McConnell spoke out against his own body's anti-piracy leg legislation Thursday urging the Democratic majority and the Republican purports to shelve the proposed bill for the foreseeable future. McConnell wants opponents and proponents of the PIPA, a PIPA, the Senate's counterpart to the House's SOPA, to resolve some of the serious issues with the legislation before moving forward with any kind of vote. While we must combat the online theft of intellectual property, current proposals in Congress raise serious legal policy and operational concerns. Kentucky, the Kentucky Republican said, rather than prematurely bringing the people to the Senate, bringing people to the Senate floor, we should first state and resolve these serious issues with this legislation. He said. Considering the bill without first doing, should so sh could be counterproductive to the shared goal of combating intellectual property theft. I encourage the Senate majority to reconsider this decision to proceed with this bill. Also, read SOPA generates 2.4 million tweets. Who says it limits online expression? He becomes the most latest and most senior congressional office to publish to publicly criticize the two primary anti piracy bills, PIPA and SOPA. A close a vote to close debate on PIPA is still scheduled for next week. But just within the past few days, five senators have withdrawn their support as public scrutiny of the legislation intensifies. Thousands of websites, including Wikipedia and Reddit, it, shut down yesterday. In protest, while the likes of Facebook CEO Mark Zuckerberg expressed their displeasure with the bill as currently written, on the House side, House Judiciary Committee Chairman Lamar Smith, yeah, has said he has every intention of moving forward with SOPA, but that will not begin until February at the earliest. Yeah, yeah. You know what? I have to say this. Lamar Smith, you are an asshole, sir. You are an asshole. You put the entire fabric of our online community in jeopardy. And if I was there right now, I'd pretty much stick the entire LP community on your ass. Really, because I'm sorry, but your ass has it coming. Yeah. Oh, yeah, another thing. A major list of support companies supporting SOPA. Wow. Yeah, you've seen all those companies you've seen before? Well, hmm. Allow me to read them for you. Mm. Give me a second here. <clears throat> anyway, these are the companies supporting SOPA, and I will be reading them. We have 1-800-CONTACTS, 1-800-PET-MEDS, 2B1-INC, 3M Company, Abro Industries, of course I never heard of these people, although I've heard of... 1-800-PET-MEDS, a cushion it, 
Adidas. Advamed. Allen Russell Photography. Alliance of Automobile Manufacturers. Alliance of Visual Artists. Ultra Client Services. American Apparel and Footwear. Really? American Association of Independent Music. Joy. American Board of Internal Medicine. American Federation of Musicians. American Gramophone LLC. American Made Alliance. American Mental Health Counselors Association. American Photographic Artists. American Societies of Composer Composers, Authors, and Publishers. American Society of Media Photographers. American Soci Society of Picture Professionals. American Watch Association. Anatology Proneme Photography. Andrea Rugg Photography. Anti-Counterfeiting and Piracy Initiative. Or ACAPI. Applied DNA Sciences. Art Holman Photography. Association of American Publishers. Association of Equipment Manufacturers. Association of Independent Music Publishers. Association of Test Publishers. AstraZeneca. Australian Medical Council. Automotive Actor Aftermarket Industry Association. Baker and Taylor. Bay State Psychological Associates. Beach Body. Beam Global Wine Spirits, even though I've never heard of them. Blue Sky Studios. Blue Sky Studios. Hmm. They made so many games, and yet my brain has went what the fuck on them. Bro Bose Corporation. Bros Biotech. Brian Stevenson. Bridget Collins. Yeah, Brian Stevenson Photography, Bridget Collins Family Support Center, BMI, Burberry, C.F. Martin and Company, Callaway Golf Company, Cascade Designs, Incorporated, Caterpillar Inc., Caveon LLC, CBS. Oh man, that's a, that's another channel I will not be watching anymore. Cengage. Too bad I was enjoying prices right and let's make a deal. Center for Credential Credentialing and Education. Center Stage Photography, CF CFA Institute, Chanel USA, Christopher Sims Photography, Church Music Publishers Association, CMH Images Coach. Coalition Against Counterfeiting and Piracy. Columbia Sportswear. Columbia Sportswear. Comcast. Commercial Photo Design. Commercial Photographers International. Comprehensive Adult Student Assessment System. Consumer Health Care Products. Association. Copyright Alliance. Copyright Clearance Center. The other CCC. Cody, Inc. Council of Fashion Designers of America. Country Music Association, really? Crop America, Amer Crop Life America, Cross Entertainment, LLC, CSA Group, CVS Caremark, Dan Sherwood Photography, Danita Delamont Stock Photography, Deco Products, Deluxe Entertainment Services, Denny Photo, Derek. Deluzio Photography, Deval Photography. Oh boy, the list is getting longer. Deluzio Photog Photog. Ah, can't read that. Actually, I'm I'm skipping through a lot of stuff. Deval Photography, Direct Selling Association, Directional Insight, Stefano Enterprises, Life Sand Studio. So were the days of our lives. Dodeguzi photograph photographic artistry. I am not reading tonight. 
Dolby Laboratories. Oh, dear. I hope they're not related to Dolby Studios. Otherwise, I'm going to be very pissed. Dulce and, Dulce and Gabbana, USA. Dollar General. Don Grawl. Dunford. Architectural Photography. Eagle Rock. Ed. Eagle Rock Entertainment. Even though I never heard of them. Oh, boy. Here we go. Ed McDonald Photography, Educational and Industrial Testing Service. Number 98, everybody's most heinous of game companies here. 98, ladies and gentlemen, Electronic Arts. They will not be getting my money. Fucking bastards. Electronic Components Industry Association, Eli Lilly and Company, Engelbert Photography, the ESA, International Entertainment Software Association. Yeah. Boy, there's, there's a lot going on that. This is. Just, uh. Let's see who else is in here that I kind of realized. Irai, Eric Miela Studio, Evidence Photographers International Council, whoever that is, Excel Outdoors, Fame Publishing Company, Fame Recording Studios. Well, I guess they're not going to live forever now, aren't they? Looks like they better learn how to fly. Because it's a STAIN! It's not going to live forever! Anyway, Far Bank Enterprises, Fashion Businesses Incorporated. You know, there's a lot going on. Graphic artists, really. Harley Davidson. Uh, yeah, I am skipping through all these names. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear, 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 dear. Dear, 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 dear. Let's see. Who else is in this? Who else is in this? Lexmark. Lexmark International. Johnson and Johnson, really? You're you're supporting this. Kenneth Garrett, photographer for National Geographic. Liz Claiborne. I didn't leave the gate open. You left the gate open. Before I was so really interrupted, where was I? L'Oreal, Liz Claiborne. One moment. Where was I? Yeah, L. I was on L'Oreal, Lucky Brand Jeans. And I, no, I've never heard of this. Hennessy. LVMH. Hennessy. Louis Vuitton. Louis Vuitton, ladies and gentlemen. Macmillan. Major League Baseball. Oh. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. The real... the, the it, It's just going to get uglier, folks. As I'm skimming through this line. And here is one of the biggie ones. Yes, the big E ones. Along with Electronic Arts, the Motion Picture Association of America. You dirty, no good sons of bitches. Uh, all these national associations, including... The NBA. That's not all. The NFL. The NFL. Yes, the NFL. NBC Universal. Man, what the fuck? NHL. 
Yes, the NHL Enterprises, they support this. <sighs> Nike, just don't do it. Oh, my Lord. Nintendo America, what have you done? What have you done to us? The PGA, but nobody gives a shit for the PGA now. Just Ralph Lauren and Raging War Raging Wires music. What the hell? Reebok, Revlon, Rolex. Really, Rolex? The Romance Writers of America. Well, I'm not part of that shit. So anyway, um, just uh, Soul Bay Entertainment, Sony. Yes, Sony. From electronics to music entertainment to pictures entertainment, they support SOPA. Who else is supporting SOPA that I know? Dow Chemicals, McGraw Hill, I can't believe it. The NCAA, Walt Disney? Oh, wait. Time Warner? Oh, r really? Time Warner? Time fucking Warner. USC? USC is supporting this shit, too? Viacom? Walmart? Oh, man. What the hell? And, of course, landing itself in... 352 is the WWE, the World Wrestling Entertainment Faction. Oh, my God. And then there's so many things. I'm tweeting this shit because, you know, why not? Because it's bullshit. It's total and uproarious bullshit. Yes. I can say this. Why? And also, they shut down Mega Upload. Mega Upload has been shut down. Now, yes, I never thought it would come to this, but... Sad but true. I got 16 followers. But anyway. Yes. All these things are, are... All these companies that I've just shown you. They are following, indeed, SOPA. It's a sad day because they want this thing to pass. Ladies and gentlemen. And as much as... I hate it as much as I can't stand the very sight of WWE now. I'm really just going to drop them all together. So many things I'm going to have to drop. I'm not going to drop my weed, but I'm just going to drop a few things that just don't belong in said conversation. <sighs> but yet, and I do mean this, yet. We must put a stop to SOPA. I mean, after doing some underhanded bullshit, I mean underhanded bullshit, such as this, no, this thing don't need to be shelled. It needs to be killed. I mean, it needs its head just lopped the fuck off because of something like this. Shut up. Because of something like this, it doesn't make sense. You're going to let this shit happen just because of one site that always stood out for us when we needed it? I think not. No, SOPA needs to be killed. SOPA definitely needs to be killed. I've sent the word out on, on Twitter and Facebook about what needs to be done. 
And for some odd apparent reason, many people are going to say, oh, I give up. You know what? I don't give up. I'm not going to give up on this on this kind of bullshit because, A, you're overturning the rules of what the president said. The president is not in is not in favor of this thing. And thank God he's still not in favor of this thing. And yet, got some asshole who is trying his damnness to push this thing as far as he can fucking take it. And yet, for some apparent reason, it does not make sense. Just for some goddamn apparent stupid ass lop headed illogically trained monkey who doesn't even know a keyboard from a typewriter in the difference between a hand up his ass or a foot in his mouth. Now, if you have Facebook, if you have Twitter, make sure you pass the word around because this thing is pissing a whole lot of people off, and for those who don't know what's going on, then will you will know what's going on. Trust me. Those who are subscribed to me, you know I always keep I always keep tabs on what's going on via email. But still, either through email or Skype, it doesn't matter. Or even through st through stream, it doesn't matter. I always report what needs to be said, and this is something that needs to be said. Sopa needs to die. Because these snakes in suits are trying their damnedest to kill our internet. And I, for one, will not fucking stand for somebody to actually try and kill the internet. Now, I don't care what what's being said right now. But what's important right now is that this thing, it needs to die. There's no excuse for doing something like that, and especially if it kills off one site. What's going to happen next? I mean, first it was Mega Upload. What's going to happen next? Is MSN going to be next on that list? Is is GameFAQs going to be on, next on that list? Is, is Reddit going to be on that I mean, what other... what? What else is going to be on that list that we don't that we don't know that know about, and we're kind of cringing in fear already? Some of us are cringing in fear. Some of us are trying to beat this thing. I am one of those people who want to beat this thing, who want to actually get this thing's ass kicked. And regardless of what is being said right now, yes, I'm angry. I'm fucking angry. I'm more than angry. I am fucking furious even though I am online every night and I give you videos and everything you know what Sopa needs his ass kicked point blank Sopa needs his ass kicked and for those of you who follow what I'm talking about please Share your feedback with me. Because bullshit like this don't make no goddamn sense. And for that, I think it's only best. It is only best that we do whatever we got to do to get these sons of bitches to stop what they're doing to our internet. They don't seem to care for us, so why the fuck should we care about them? Anyway, I've been the Tenkaichi of gaming. I have spoken. And I'm left in the banner to fight for our internet. I don't know how many are going to stand with me. I hope you guys stand with me. I know you guys out there. 
You know who you are. Cause I'm gonna stand with you too. On the front lines. So yeah, that is that is just one fucked up way to to end the day. So hopefully I get to hear some feedback about this issue of the evil son of a bitch called Sopa and Peepa. Have a good night, everybody.